way back. Before we go on, though, um, we're going to take a little trip. I want to fill up my sub tanks. And here is a really good way to do it if you've got all the weapons and all the everything. If you don't, Morph Moth stage is good because there's a bit of the ladder where the two shield dudes are on each side. That's not too bad a spot. Okay. There's one. Oops. Turn around and jump. Hi. Hate having to wait for that last one. Alright, so if we use our super secret awesome head upgrade, it'll tell us there's something there. And if we take Silk Shot and charge it, we get health. And every time we charge it, we get another batch of health. One batch will fill a sub tank. There's all our sub tanks. There's one in Crystal Snail stage that gives you weapon energy, which is stupid. Because why would you need it? Um. And I think the one in Bubble Crab stage might give you both. Again, don't know. Anyway. This is exciting, isn't it? I do have uh, some assistance for this one. Because there's a special. Like we had a Hadoken in Mega Man X1. We've got a similar here in Mega Man X2. And I just don't remember how to exactly get to it. Because I haven't played this one as much, so... I do like the X Hunter stage music. I think it's pretty good. It ain't great, but it's pretty good. I love doing that. Don't like this game's version of the shield, guys. I just like because I can shoot that and then get out of the way. Ah, you jerk. You jerk. You mees, taha. Multiple paths in a couple of these stages. Harkening back to some of the original Mega Man stages that way. But they both bring you out here. for? This is Mega Man. Mega Man don't have bosses. So, we get to fight these guys again. With, he's just got this 
the slightest of alteration of these blocks, which sometimes helps, sometimes hurts. He's still a jerk just because he does so much damage. How could he have overloaded my circuits? He used bubbles! Oh no! My one weakness bubbles. Wah. <laughs> I don't care. much with that. So, here's something this game does that I think is questionable. And the first one did it, and I think it was questionable there too, but I could just leave, go fill up my sub-tanks and come back. And be, like, right where I left off. I never liked, when I was a kid, anyway, being trapped in Wily's castles. But now that I have the option in this game to leave... I don't love it. We'll probably do it. Because I'll probably have used another sub tank, but. Yeah, see, you can't hurt him when he's doing that. You guys are pretty good for dropping health. Alright, now these things again. Told you, I didn't like them. And this is why I don't like them. Because they show up in this stage. And you gotta use them to maneuver these spike traps. And I don't know. Fall down! Don't like it. We're just going to tank the fire. Now. Like I said, that's more of a utility item than a... Than a weapon. Trying to remember how to do this. Oh, well, screw that. Did not mean to do that. I'll take some health. Yeah. Um. Actually, I'm going to tell you guys something. I think... I think this is actually the one and only time this is useful. He got an upgrade. So got to take care of those little pod things in front before you can hurt him. But once you do, he just has these two shots. One shoots straight up and down, one shoots diagonally.
It wouldn't be so bad if he was just, you know, he could hit him. It's kind of the same problem you have when you fight him the first time. He's not, he's not necessarily tough, he's just hard to hit, because he's always hiding behind something. there. No, you're not going to come down now, huh? Alright, we'll heal again. I know it's not as strong shot for shot, but I can at least hit him, you know? Unless he's hitting me, and I can't. Right in the face. Uh, it's impossible. The prophecies. Do robots have prophecies? I guess so. Well, I'm dead now. Bye. Now we will pop back and refill our uh, sub tanks. And you don't need to see that. Oh, you know. Okay. This one. <clears throat> this is a special stage. A, this is the most Mega Man X3 sounding music in all of Mega Man X2. This is what all of the music in X3 sounds like to me. Something we haven't shown off is uh, supposedly. No, okay. I thought Spike Chain could reach in there, or Strike Chain could grab that stuff, but guess not. I gotta be careful here because I don't remember, like I said, exactly. Mario 3 garbage. our Giga Crush, Gaga Crush, Gravity Crush, whatever. Need that bat back. <laughs> Just an annoying... Ah! They're in annoying spots in this stage, in this game. All right, so let's see. Uh, we can we need to go up. So I need, I need you, Batman. Like I said, utility item. Really, buddy? You throw him that far, huh? I think I need that bat, too. Oop, screwed that up. Okay. Yeah, that's nice, isn't it?
Hug the wall. I swear that was longer. <clears throat> wow, you were so cool. Shut up with your Wayne's World reference. Wasn't that good a movie? It's not as good as you remember it. Yay, we have a sure you can. We can only do it when our health is full. I wish she said something. This is basically game breaking. Okay. And I plan to break the game with it when possible. I need that guy. Okay, Agile is our next boss. And this version of Agile sucks. So I'm actually going to show you a little bit of the fight and then the easy way to beat him. So this is what he do. And then he's going to drop spikes on you. You got to do that. I'm up. Try and get him, and you shoot him, and it sucks. And I don't know what he's weak to. Other than this. Oh, this cannot be! Makes me immune to spikes, even. It's, it's breaky. I don't care. I don't like that fight. Okay. Ooh, spooky. Oh, we've seen these before. Haven't we? Yes, we have. That's the answer. We have. No other answer will do. There are some small differences uh, with the bosses this go around. Um, mostly their attack patterns are going to be a little different. I.e. to wit. Um. Bosses that have multiple forms, like Flame Stag technically does, I think he will start just in his second form, which is a little more aggressive than his first form. It just seems to take a really long time fighting the bosses in this game to me. Especially when I gotta wait for him to, you know, ninja smoke vanish all the time. Oh, look at you. Very clever. That's right, Mega Man, you blink. You've earned it. Look at you blinking. With your eyes. Um, unfortunately, this doesn't mean we've got to do, like, Wheel Gator again. Crystal Snail again. The bosses in this game aren't great. 
Did I not switch to your weakness? I thought I did. Jerk. Get out of here. Now, as fun as it is fighting him with his weakness, it does mean you have his shell to contend with. And yeah, yeah, you can kick it around the room to keep him from getting back in it. Still just an annoying fight. Stop kicking it towards him, you jerk. I, I do not like his fight. Never have. Even with the weakness, don't like it. Not, I'm not a fan of games that make me wait. And that's why I don't like... And I don't mean... Like, like I'm fine if I gotta wait for something. Like a, like a cutscene sometimes. If it's like an actual interesting cutscene. But... Him and Wheel Gator and... Uh, I, I don't like it. And again, I swear I had your weakness selected. If this were like Mega Man 4, Mega Man 2, Mega Man 6, even Mega Man X1, we wouldn't have had to hit him that many times with his weakness. Like, you got his weakness, you basically got it figured out. Here you go. You win. Good job. I don't, I don't like the layout of this room. Alright, we have it selected. We go in. We lose it. Okay, I'm not going crazy. Um, charging up wire... S not wire sponge. Crystal snail's weapon. Um, basically lets you do like a slow down time thing. Come on, you jerk. So when he turns into the drill, and he grabs onto the wall like that, he bites it and makes it pointy. And as everybody knows, robots are weak to pointy things. So now Mega Man can't, like, he'll take damage. And yeah, I'm going to abuse the hell out of save states in this fight. Because it's a boring fight. I should be able to hit him twice. I swear. I don't know why that one worked. 
Does the does the goop shield him? It might. I know I've never been able to do that before. That's an awful big explosion. Just saying. Just saying. I don't know why these platforms don't have energy. I feel like they should. Not because I need it. Like, we're good. But why have six of them? If only four are going to have energy. I ain't even going to bother to equip a weapon since it ain't going to matter anyway. That's the annoying thing, is the, the trash will block our attack. I also think this is pretty crummy boss music. Uh, getting the um, dust on you will confuse you. It turns you purple and it reverses your directional controls. Pretty sure. For sure? No, but pretty sure. <clears throat> you could stop just dropping me off at the bottom of the room. That'd be great. Notice how much smaller his room is. So, had we fought Overdrive first, we would have obviously his weakness. Still have to watch him do this stupid. I don't know if you guys remember this from uh, your biology class when you learned that sponges can control lightning. He at least gets an interesting death, I guess. We cut him in half. Yeah, no, totally. Sponges can control lightning. You didn't know that? Look it up. Get on uh, Facebook. Because that's no misinformation on Facebook. Oh, no. Alright, so who we got left? Uh, we should have Bubble Crab and Flame Stag, right? Yep. So he's got spikes up there now. So we want to watch out for those. Since when do crabs jump? Oh, that was your fault. Totally your fault. Um, I think if he... I think if he fires his little crabs out like he did when we fought him, they hit the spikes and break, and they grab onto you or something. I don't remember for sure. So this should be Flame Stag, right? Yep. 
sometimes I don't jump to my full height. What's going on with my phone? Blowing up! Oh, for sake. Comments. Emails. Christ. If I wanted to talk to you people, I wouldn't be in my room playing video games. Oh, Sigma! Oh no! How did he know? We, we, something. I don't know. What, Sigma? Accentures have failed. Don't worry, I have arranged a new toy. Are you very excited? You should leave. That place is blowing up. I don't remember if our weapons refill or not. I also don't care. Wait, this isn't here. This is Magna Centipede stage. What's going on? Oh no, we're totally refilled. Didn't use a sub tank. That's kind of lazy, isn't it? Like we're just going to exactly reuse a stage? Right? It's not just me. Uh, if you didn't get the items, I don't think you can get them here. You know, like if you didn't get the heart or the sub tank. That door wasn't there last time. How come your teleporter works like that? How come you look stupid? You got like Castlevania three colors. Hi, Zero, why are you black? He's just wandering around. I was just going to the store, getting some Slim Jims, RC Cola. Oh, I let him die. Oh, that's just a bummer, isn't it? You repay that favor. Oh no, what was that? Dun dun dun. Study them blueprints. There's only one zero. Wait. I know your secret. You were destined to follow me. Maybe, but I don't like you. Fine. Meh. Let me just. No animation, just through the ceiling. Hi, Zero! Ah, sorry. I was in three pieces? You don't want to know the day I had. We gotta defeat the Mavericks, including Sigma. Yeah, I already did it! Main computer. Why are you punching the ground? That's not ahead, that's below. That's ahead, you went ahead. I gotta go below. Clunk. Fell into a cutscene. Watch out. Now there's a ceiling. Okay. So, a couple things about old Sigma here. Um. I think uh, Sonic Slicer, pretty sure, but he's got another weakness, if you can pull it off. Yeah, he's Wolverine now. You can do it. Damn you. I tried to use the analog stick to control Mega Man. There. 
It's really kind of garbage. I don't care. We're pretty much done. Now, I think... Hey, give me that health. Yeah, we can just sure you can him too. Hey, buddy, your head explode. <laughs> uh, uh, strike chain will work on that form of Sigma. That I know. He's not really. I lost again. I'm a saying. Every time you beat me, I get stronger. Remember that time I was ahead? Why well, did zero? Because I put it back together. Oh, uh, we want to know more about that until Mega Man X5, which was supposed to be the last one. And then they screwed up for three games. Well, two games, I guess. Kind of three. I'm going to include four. And then they made eight, and eight saved it. But six and seven are terrible. Anyway. When it comes to weaknesses, we maybe have talked about this ever so slightly while this plays on. But, uh... I remember there being a chart for Mega Man 3 back in a Nintendo Power that told you how much damage each weapon did to each Robot Master. And some of them are terrible, like zero, one, but almost everything would do two damage to somebody. In this game, you're lucky to get three. That gravity crush thing will do two damage to every boss. Like, Overdrive Ostrich, he'll take three damage from his weakness. You gotta hit him 11 times. If you charge, I th think, the speed burner and hit Morph Moth with it, it'll do six damage. You still got to hit him six times. Anyway, is peace a dream? Are robots and humans meant to live forever? What is the price of peace, Zero? Answer me these questions. You are my only true friend, my pointy-headed companion. like very just it just like dumps all this really heavy like what will Mega Man sacrifice in the name of peace will he be able to do it only time will tell and then everything up till now is like I've got need more time Mega Man Go install them, and I'll put Zero back together. Anyway, I'm going to get out of here. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. I had a good time replaying this. It's it's not a terrible game. It's not my favorite, but it's, it's pretty good. Thankfully, I didn't have to replay... Oh, did I have to do X4? It sticks out in my head that I had to do X4 already. God, I hope not. Anyway, thank you guys again. I'll see you next time. Appreciate you watching.